Right, so now we have the rig, we have the agent layers, the shape library and the clips. So the last part is the transform groups. But before we create that, I'm going to go out, I'm going to go to this mockup Viper 3 that we created the original agent from, and I'm going to change this from zombie to pose and t-pose, just because I think it's a little bit nicer to, to have a t-pose. And I'm going to go and call this clip, a clip name rest, that is good. And I'm also going to turn off the clips on these two. And by doing that, Oh, I also need to reload the clip. So let's go and reload. And there is our T-Pose. So now we can go down here. We see we have a T-Pose down here as well. And now let's drop down an agent transform group. And what I want to do, I want to create a group for each arm. And I want to do that because later in the simulation, I want to have even more variation by creating damaged arms for them. And then I will have those arms driven by partial ragdolls. And as I know that I will do that later, I just want to prepare for that. So I have this agent transform group node. And uh, let's start by creating a left arm group. And I'm going to go in, in the hierarchy here. And I'm going to go to left arm to left forearm. So I'm going to select that one. And if I want to see what's included in my group, I can select this show guide geometry. And now it's hard to see with the geometry on. So I can tap W to go into wire. And here you can see my group. I have also an option to do a gradual blend into a group. So I can use this blend into groups. And you can see now this here is black and this goes up to blue. And it's driven by these ramps. You can see I can, if I change this, now this get a little bit bluer because you have more weight on that joint uh, or, and so on. But, but first, right now, I'm not going to use that. I'm just going to turn that off. And then I'm going to create the next group, which I'm going to call right arm. I'm going to turn off this show guide geometry here as well. And right arm. And I'm going to do a similar thing, but on the right side. So I'm going to go down here to right arm, to right forearm, and accept. And we can check that as well. So there we go. So here are our two groups. Sweet. All right. So now we are ready to start making a crowd. Let me go to the agent definition cache. I'm going to save that. And I can load it back. And here is our saved agent. And we can drop down an agent edit. And you can see, so he has all his clips. So we have, you can see we have our rest. Yes, we have our walks and idols they all look good. And we can also see if we have the party layer. Yes, party zombie layer. There we go. Cool. Okay. 